Good evening, my friends. Today, today I'm going to share from 1 Corinthians 13, verse 12. And I'll just read. He says, For now we see through a glass, darkly, but then face to face. Now I know in part, but then shall I know even as I also am known. <laughs> For now we see through a glass darkly, but then face to face. Now I know in part, but then shall I know even as also I am known. And I just, man, it just, it just blows my mind, right? I mean, first of all, we really need to get a grasp on the fact that there's going to be a day where it's going to be normal to see the Lord face to face. <laughs> I mean, this life is temporary and it's, it's working towards establishing the eternal but the most interesting thing here to me is then shall I know even as also I am known and there's an aspect to to God's knowledge of us that that we that we also need to to consider you know what I mean like like based on what Jesus said you know Jesus says, the hairs of your head are all numbered. You are worth more than many sparrows. Like we are valuable to God. The hairs of our head are numbered. I mean, to know how we are known, that, that we are known is something. What are we? <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, like in John, it says, we do not know yet what we shall be, but we know when he appears, we shall be like him. So there's this revelation of God's plan for mankind and, and, and us personally that has yet to be manifested. I mean, we, we see that you know, he's building us up as a body for the temple of the Holy Spirit. We're going to be his body. We, we know that he's going to live in us. And, you know, we're the earthen vessels that are filled with the glory of God. We know that, uh, that we're going to reign and, and judge and govern the world um, with Christ. But there's this other thing that that we don't really understand yet. That we won't know until we're there. And this is what we're looking forward to. The 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 revelation, the 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 fulfillment of the mystery of creation and what what God really intended and is doing. We can never fully know here. It will always be unknown until we get there. It'll always be hidden from us, like it's seeing through a glass darkly, like a dark glass. We can't make out the image. It's not clear to us. It's obscured. And that's okay. Because it's promised. We just need to realize that whatever's coming is going to be so far exceedingly abundantly greater and better than what we're having it to experience now. <laughs> we really need to start looking forward to death and eternity where we're going to know how we are known. We, we are a spectacle here. We are being watched. I mean... Take heart. Amen.